morning. I'm Rebecca Salzer, the Communications Coordinator at Mayfield, and this Wednesday devotion is a follow-up to Pastor Jim's um, message from this past Sunday. If you didn't see it, it's on our uh, Mayfield channel on YouTube, and I, um, I ask that you listen to it and, and just hear of, how, of different ways of how we could be in community during this time in the pandemic. It's, um, we've tried to think outside the box as a staff and as, um, as a world of how to communicate to one another uh, since it's not the same. So anyway, um, one idea came to me when my son Nathan turned seven uh, last month in September and he received a card from Neil and Edna Johnson. And if you know them, they've been longtime members of Mayfield Church. Um, and they actually got to know each other pretty well because of a common interest, which is trains. One day, Neil was wearing a train sweatshirt, and I asked him about it, if he liked trains. And um, it would be an understatement to say he <laughs> just liked them. He has a gorgeous uh, table in his basement of a, a train. And I'll show you this video. So fast forward to when Nathan got this card in the mail from the Johnsons. He was so excited and wanted to see him again and um, see them at church because that's his highlight on Sunday morning. It came to me that what if we created a pen pal ministry of where we could set a couple people up with each other and write or communicate, learn about one another. We could kind of go old school or email depending on who your pen pal is. And I'll give more instructions, but in this e-blast um, and website below in the details of this video, I'm gonna write how you can fill out a questionnaire to find a, a pen pal in our church and also get more details on what this is all about and if we could just be there for one another. One other reason why I had thought this route is because everybody is struggle, struggling. Um, I read something on Facebook once of who's struggling the most during this pandemic. And I really thought it was me because I am a mom of two small children. And it was very interesting to read of everybody is struggling in one way or another. Um, our leaders are people who are alone, who don't have to care for a younger child, those who are grieving because they can't grieve properly, those who have lost, those who are sick, um, those who are just alone. So this is where we could all benefit and have um, some type of communication with one another. So go ahead and email me if you have any questions. If not, uh, fill out the questionnaire and I will pair you up with someone they might be someone you know, might be somebody you've never heard of at Mayfield Church, but everyone is welcome to do this. All right, I hope you have a great week.